We're back. Back. To another episode of Nothing to Do. I'm your host, Jeremy. Across from me is your host, Michael. Fucking phone died. I feel fucking dead now. <laughs> How we doing? All right. What's up with you? Oh, man. Chilling, man. Another amazing week or what? Bro. Sheesh. What happened? Same shit, just different, just different, just di- different day, right? That's all it is. Word. No nah, man, I'm gonna have to put on my big boy, my big boy pants at work this week. It what, looks like why? What happened? Dude, so I, I got <laughs> I got called into detention. <laughs> you got called into detention. I got called into detention. You got and I met. You with got the reprimanded. Principal. I got reprimanded. Why? What happened? They listened to the podcast? No, no, not yet. Yeah, oh, not yet. You know your, not job, <laughs> your job is done once. Not there. yet. <laughs> not that. yet. I got a coworker. She's like, shit. Jeremy was saying some shit that one part. About them kids, you can't even talk about them kids like that. You can't even say that. <laughs> yeah, yeah. If they listen to that, and he's done. I was like, yo, you're right. You're absolutely right. Yeah. Um, what happened, Jeremy? Talk to us. Tell us. It was just like, yo, I don't show like, yo, this is just one of those schools. It's just like, you know, like everybody's always like friendly, hi, blah, blah, blah whatever. Yeah. Like I'm not, that's I'm the, there, I'm there to do my work. No, no, no. That's the vibe that you have to give up. Yep. That's like, yeah, that, that school was like Chick-fil-A. Like, I mean, if you como, can't, como así. like, you, every employee in Chick-fil-A is the, the, the nicest person in the world. That's yeah. kind of like, you have to put that on <laughs> the resume. My pleasure. My pleasure. You have to put that on the resume. Can you smile 24-7, yeah. no matter what, have a good, fu- that's, yeah, that's yeah, yeah. cool. Yeah. It's happy day, Pleasant Valley. Like, you have to. You would you would Yay. think that like my tenure there would would give me some leeway. They don't nope. give a fuck about they you. Not. What? They do not. They don't yo, they what? Well, yo, my one of my bosses. So you have had, a stale face on, and they're mad about it. I mean, everybody got a stale face with the mask on, right? We all got masks on. That's right. That's but yeah, right, energy's right? not. It's it's yo, not coming it's, off the I, way they want. Yeah, it's, you know, it's one of those damn if you do, damn if you don't. Because it's like when I try to be nice or like try to say hi, like niggas put their head down, like they scared of me. Or like the times, or vice versa. Like you know what I'm saying. So, At the end of the day, I'm trying to make sure these kids don't get COVID out here. So, <laughs> so, like, so, tell me what that mean. Like specifically, what did they say? They said, "Oh man, I'll Jeremiah be- Garcia." Uh, Jeremy? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I wish I had, I had intended to bring the the sheet they gave me. They, they gave like, you a sheet, a paper. No, like a paper. They page wrote and this half. down. 500 words. No. Like, of your wrote fuck this ups? down of my fuck ups. No way. And I was like, No way. I remember just reading, I was like, Yo, this is a lot of shit. Wow. <laughs> Yo. I was like, This is a lot out. of shit. They, damn, they had, they got time on their hands, bro. They See. wrote out a whole essay on how you've been fucking up. Yup. Wow. A whole, yup. Wow. Page and a half. You know, single spaced. Just, I mean, I'm trying to put myself in your shoes. Someone come at me with a page and a half of fuck ups. The other mic comes out. I start. I'm gonna get pissed. Like, yeah. Nah, 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 nah. Fuck out of here. Yeah, yeah, you know yeah. what I do over here for you guys? Yeah. Let's get into that. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh fuck yeah. Fuck the fuck ups. Listen, I had to yo. I had to bite my tongue for a little no, bit. I had to let speak. Of and when it was my turn to speak. Y'all crossed my legs like a mob boss. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Like, listen, and listen, yeah. listen. Yeah. Yo, give me your attention. Because what pissed me off, right? Yeah. Is Whatever, like, there's no, like, there was no, this whole T, the TA positions, all this shit was super last minute because of everything going on this year. Of course, year. of course. And so, like, I've been mad patient. I don't complain. At the end of the day, I talk about this on the, on the show before. Like, yo, I don't got to take these fucking kids home with me, right? Yeah, yeah. Like, I open the clothes. I'm in there at 7. I leave at 5.30. Yeah. Yeah, it's tiring, but, like, whatever. And it's just, like, instead of, like, but we've never, like, I work with second grade and us, all the teachers involved with second grade, we've never had a, a meeting about anything, mm. about expectations, about who should do what. Uh, but like I said, this one class is like the hardest class in the school, and the other class is pretty good. Like that class, like they don't, she could do that shit by herself right. if she needs to. She should, and she's been, she's a vet. Right. But right, so there was a period like someone we come up with a some lady comes up with a tentative schedule or like how, who's gonna be with who in the morning who's gonna be with who in the evening right or in the afternoon and i wasn't scheduled to be with uh, this one teacher in the afternoon and the other teacher had music class at the end of the day and it's like the un, like music class is free time for all of us the music teacher handles that shit dolo so i took that time to go to my apartment, get to like just take a break before the fucking after school shit starts, bro. As soon as I come back, 
I come back on time, by the way. Word. I'm always I'm always on time. Word. Yo, the the assistant the the assistant or one of the heads of schools comes in and sees me coming in and she fucking chews me out in front of everybody, in front of mad teachers. Mm. And I was like, and I just stood there, took it. I was like, yo. And I t- and then I had to talk about it to me. And I was like, yo, I didn't I didn't like that shit. Like mm. you, like you said, we had a talk because we had a talk. I had a talk with her like twenty minutes before. And I guess we were having two different conversations because mm. she comes at me like, oh, I thought we talked about this before. And she's like, nah, I guess you were tiptoeing about what you wanted to really tell me because I thought we were talking about something else completely different. Mm. And yeah, and I told her straight up, I was like, yo, I've been at the school 15 years. I worked here for mad long. I was a student here, blah, blah, blah. And then you, you, you come at me like you chastise me. In front of all my colleagues, all my peers, like I'm a some, like I'm a student here still. Mm. I was like, I deserve more respect than that. Like, fuck that. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, but it is what it is. So she chewed you out for what? For leaving and coming yeah, back? Yeah, for leaving. She was like, your team needed you, like, and you weren't there. And we have all these group, t- like, we have group texts going on. And, like, I was like, yo, if somebody needed me, they could have texted me. Like, when there's music going on and I wasn't scheduled to be here, mm. like, y'all have never needed me. Like, I have to kill that time. So I decided to kill that time off campus. I had to take care of some stuff. So, like, you know what I'm saying? What else was on the uh, 50 word essay that Bro, was on? Uh, if I remember, I'll bring that shit in next There's week. There's gotta I be some key notes that you was like, huh? Bro, it was like lack of, lack of, uh, sh- lack of, like, my harshness towards children. Like, I don't, like, the, like, it, like, it's just, it was mad shit. I didn't even read the whole thing because I didn't, I was like, yeah, yeah la- this is you fucking, lacking in, in like, like, discipline in No, the lacking in, like, in, in, like, they say, like, my tone is too harsh, the way, like, they just don't like the way I approach the job. But, yeah. yo, I know I get shit done there. Word. For a fact. I know those kids, and I know those kids love me. I, I bet you if, if, like, if if they if those kids ask their parents who their favorite teacher is, it would probably be me. Mm. Or one of, it, I, I'd be top, I'd be top, I'd be in their top five. Word. Word. You know? And, yeah, them second grade kids. Yeah. And them second grade kids. Damn, but. but. But whatever, yo. You know. When did that start? That was right Monday? What are we talking here? When this did was, this was I had my first meeting with, with one of my bosses on like Tuesday. We went for like a walk for like twenty minutes. And I thought she was trying to pick my brain about the position because it was so new and there was no guidance. I thought she was just trying to see like what do you think works, what do you think doesn't work, like how do you approach shit? But apparently she was low key like trying to tell me like I'm fucking up my job right now. Mm. And it's just like and it was funny because one of the other bosses, like, they didn't even know that I didn't, like, we never had this, like, they escalated shit before even realize, even fe- finding out whether I met with my team, or my team met with me about anything at all. Mm. So then they felt stupid, probably, like, you escalated this, but you didn't, you uh, you haven't even, like, niggas been snitching on me, but they never, they never had a conversation with me about with you anything. about yeah. it. So is it, like, so this your team, quote, unquote, members upset with you about certain things like i don't understand and they're going up to her i guess so yeah so what have you gone up have you gone up to them and be like yo what's what's up what's the what the problem that's what i'm saying i'm about to put on my big boy pants and i'm I'm literally gonna have to call a meeting and run the meeting Uh. for these grown-ass women (laughs) (laughs) who are saying then they look at you like a little boy yeah for sure so now I'm gonna have to take the correa out. No. I say chancla. No, it's the correa yeah. that's coming. Out. The fat, the 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 thick joint pause. <laughs> Super pause. pause. <laughs> the thick joint, cause pops used to take out the. Yo, that belt must have been. I don't even know how you put it through them fucking pant loops, cause it must have been at least four inches wide, cause that. Yeah. Was, <laughs> holy shit. Kids these days don't know what hincate means, my nigga. That shit's crazy, dog. Like, hincate, I ain't mean one. Right in the corner of a room, dog. You just gotta sit there, knees peeling up from the rug. Mm-hmm. Your mom ever had you? Nah, your mom's not torturous like that. There's no <laughs> way. Mom. My mom? How about hincate on, 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 on the rice? On the rice. No, I don't think I've ever not on the rice. Not on the maybe rice. once. I don't remember ever being on the rice. Definitely got the belt from my mom. She Word. denies it. Word. Got the chancla. Yeah. I got the fist. I got with the, the belt. I got the fist with the ring one. I got I was belt too straight off, it. straight off. Um, Banya to me, who with a smile. Look at me. <laughs> with a smile. I was in the boys and girls club past the past dinner time. Yeah. Because east side was right across the street. It was, it was like a. 
it was like a tournament. I think like my team needed me. Like uh-huh, I needed uh-huh, to play. Uh-huh. We had the late game or something. Like yeah, yeah. Go crush this. I go back home. Oh, oh no, stop being me. It's okay. Just take a take a bath. Go ahead. Go in. Uh huh. Straight out the bath. Look a wet. Hey. <laughs> hey, <laughs> bunk. Like, oh shit. <laughs> my Trust me. The, I think one of the, I think I remember pops. Somebody made me hold gallons of water. Like the cross. Yeah, like you that. Nice. I swear to God, bro. Like, <laughs> like Mr. Miyagi. That. You're sitting there like <laughs> yeah. that, trembling like that. Back to the gallons of water, nigga. I swear to you. I swear to you, bro. That's creative, but I'll nah, tell you, nah, I never nah, heard nah, the nah, gallon nah, one. Nah, nah. That's some Mr. Miyagi one shit. Time, damn, I'm on a tangent. I remember one time he told me he ain't got there in his room, right? In his corner, it's dark there in the living room. I got brave or something. I was like, I'm not taking this no more. Cause uh-huh. I got up. Went in front of the TV, Doug turned it off on him uh-huh. and tried to speak my point. Right? Uh-huh, uh-huh. By the time I turned back, <laughs> Pops was rushing off that couch, boy. Just grabbed me like that. <laughs> boy, he, he opened up his room and just threw me, dog. Right on his back. <laughs> oh, fucking. Dog. Never again did I challenge that because never throw a challenge up. big boy pants yeah, on. Yeah, I tried to put my big boy pants on, but. It didn't work. We're not taking this no <laughs> more. Yo, I, sh- I, sh- <laughs> I marched to the living room, turned the TV off. Bro, I swear to God, I turned around. And he was already off the couch, bro, rushing me. It was great. It was good times. Kids need that. Yeah, we do, right? Yeah. So, that sucks to hear. I bet LeBron, that, that was probably LeBron in the locker room. Game Word. five with Danny Green, bro. They going game know, six. Man. I don't know. Again, it shows. It tells me. I don't care. I don't care about the right basketball play. It tells you. It tells you a lot about him as a, as the quote unquote. Oh, definitely one of the best players ever. Mm-hmm. But when it's it's fucking game five, the ball's in your hand. Ten seconds left. And they got down the whole, by one. The whole team is on fuck. you, bro. It don't matter. It does not matter. And you, Danny Green you is a champion. You to take the shot. No way, bro. No Danny way. Green, is a, Danny, Danny Green hit that it shot for the Spurs. Matter. He should hit it that shot matter. for LeBron. It doesn't matter, bro. It does. Kobe would not. He's not passing. LeBron. Yo, the I Kobe mean, memes. <laughs> Kobe's never going to pass. Jordan's never going to give that shot. Maybe to Steve Kerr. That one time he gave it to Steve. That's it, bro. He's taking that shot, though. He's taking that shot. Well, they got two more games to, to dug it out. You know, nah, for sure. I'm not saying that now they, they lost it. <laughs> they were saying he's like now I got now he's gonna drop drop like 65 to win. He's like I I really gotta. He has to like yo. You know, see LeBron. It's like you damned if you do, you damned if you don't. Because if he did take that shot, what's no, the headlines nobody, the next day? No one's no. The headlines would not be like he should have passed the ball. Hell yeah. I don't know. Hell, Hell no. yeah. I don't know. Look, Damian Lillard shot the nigga. Team. I guess you, bro. I I see right now NBA and TNT. You know how they had the race to the board. This nigga Kenny Smith circling Danny Green and fucking Markeith Morris. You had him here, here. You have all these niggas here. Blah blah blah, bro. You talking about quote unquote the best player? Yo, bro, you you supposed to take that shot, bro. And I, it doesn't mean that you have to take it from from the bottom of the key. I mean, from the bottom of the uh, in, in the paint with three people on you. Yeah, you know I mean, he had Jimmy Butler one on one at at the three point. Well, he was driving to the three. Then the double team came. It's not like you have to go to the paint. You could set up, do fuck, spread the court out, and take somebody one on one and take the shot. You don't have to drive and try to kick it. His intention was to drive and kick it at 10, 15 seconds left in the okay. game with the championship in his head. His mind said. I'm going to drive and kick it. Instead of, I'm taking this fucking shot to win the championship. I'm the best player ever. That's a fucking difference, bro. That's a big That's a difference. difference. That's a big difference, dog. Damn. Shout out to him. He is. Shout out to- <laughs> Genetically, bro, there's never going to be someone like LeBron ever. Ever, yeah. ever, ever. Well, we got we got game six tonight. I had a feeling I had a feeling that he were going to at least take another one. No, I think I said it in the last episode. And I said it again. Duncan Robinson, hero of the game again, <laughs> Doug. Fucking unsung white boy, man. Everyone's great, talking white hope, about, great white hope. Everyone's talking about Tyler Hero. Doug, Duncan Robinson is the man, dog. He undrafted. You know what I mean? He was undrafted? Undrafted. Undrafted went to the D-League, son. Like, bald and came up. He's a... Boy, boy, <laughs> how do you not like that Heat team? You gotta root for them. Yeah, it's like you have to. It's David and Goliath. You have to root for yeah. them. Yeah, 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 yeah. But who's David? Who's Goliath in this one? He, he's <laughs> Goliath, bro. The Heat got a monster team of fucking the best player ever, Anthony Davis. No, they don't. 
Come but, on. But I mean, like. They got heart. That's all it is, dog. Yeah, they do got a lot of heart. That's it. A lot of heart. And that's going to take you far. And a lot of young talent. Anyways. And Jimmy Butler. This, uh, my week. What the fuck I do this yeah, week? Well, I was. Same shit. I had to you, work fucking. I saw you were working the weekends, right? This weekend? Yeah, I had to work fucking. I went in at Friday night at 6. We got on like 7 Saturday morning, dog. Yesterday was. My yesterday. Saturday was shot. And. Just my luck is like beautiful as fuck outside. I fucking wake up because I knocked out at eight in the morning. I wake up it's like noon. The fam's downstairs. I go outside real quick. I'm like, wow, what a fucking beautiful day. Yeah. And I feel like garbage. I gotta. I'm about to eat and go right back to sleep because I. I'm just tired. I'm dead tired. Yeah. So, whatever. Woke up last night. We dropped off Kenny. We went on a date night. Just drinking all that bullshit. And now I'm here. That's nice. Y'all got a little date night in. Where. About to take my daughter pumpkin picking after this too, or yeah. apple picking or something. One of them cute little activities. Yeah. Since we all got the day off tomorrow, I think. Oh, that's oh that, yeah, yep. It's not National Oppressors Day. <laughs> <laughs> you got it off, right? I know your school is definitely celebrating Columbus. Oh yeah, we got fall. They call it Fall Weekend. Fall Weekend. Fall Weekend. Oh, they PC like that. Oh yeah, 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 yeah big time. They, they won't even acknowledge his name. I thought. Oh yeah, no, I don't. I wow. think it's it's a thing everywhere now. They be taking. They've been taking down statues, and they've been. Wow. What else have they been doing? They've been taking down statues. Like so some, Thanksgiving's some call it next. next. No, no, Thanksgiving's yo, next. Yo, Thanksgiving, right? Yeah. Thanksgiving's next. We'll give it. I give it four <laughs> more years before people are like, Nah, listen, we can't even. You know, we're celebrating right here the treason of the pilgrims. No, 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 no. Yeah, we're gonna have to. We're gonna have to call this something else. We're gonna have to. Yeah. No more Dennis. No more. <laughs> <laughs> Matter of fact, everyone go to fucking work. <laughs> yo, chill. <laughs> yo, yo, yo. I heard. Yo, my God, bro. Like the the. I don't even know if I want to say it, yo. But like, so the head of school fucking calls. I guess they had a faculty meeting, mm. and they said, you know, the, the head of school is giving everybody that week off on um uh, for Thanksgiving. Mm. And the first thing that that one of the teachers of of the the mother of those two children uh, oh. is is their daycare. No, nigga, stay at home with your kids. <laughs> is it what you I just mean? Took you, I just gave you the week off. Cause what do you mean? <laughs> is there daycare? No, nigga. Bueno. Is there is there double overtime? <laughs> That's my question. Is it double overtime? Oh man. But I don't got kids. They ain't my kids. Where? Fuck them kids. Oh, <laughs> tampoco, tampoco, tampoco. Look. Tampoco así, yo. Uh-huh. Tampoco así. Yo. Uh, what's the difference between a gator and a crocodile? You want to look that up? Not really. Uh, but you should. <laughs> I have no idea. I think a gator... I think that's just rednecks called gators. <laughs> no, alligators. Right? So what's the alligators, alligators and, and crocodiles? crocodiles? I don't know. I think a size difference. The size, mean difference. size difference. Yeah, I think so. I think one is like you go down to Florida and you see him. He's like, ah, it's just a gator. But you go and you see a cock. They're like, you gotta run. You know what I mean, <laughs> I think that's the thing. You see, I like. You see how, like, they be at the PGA Tour, and all of a sudden, like, the Gator comes on. They're like, oh, whatever. They play through. Uh-huh. That was a croc. No. No one's going to be playing through. <laughs> Everyone's like, it's a croc now. Eh, eh, gotta go. Them Gators. <laughs> gotta go. Oh, play, that's why, play, that's why Gatorade's called Gator. Gator. From Miami Gators, Florida yeah, Gators. Florida Gators. That's fine. That's when they decided to call it Gatorade. That's why it's called Gator Aid. That was a, that was a good commercial. Gator. That Gator. was good and informative. <laughs> Let's Gator talk about. Aid. You know what I want to talk about real quick, yo. Now that this that just. So, I've been noticing a lot of m- more commercials and my daughter's like little uh, little channels and shit about like pooping toys, like like little like like toys that that need to go to the bathroom and then you sit them down on like a toilet and then like for like body training. Out. But they're toys though, like right. I don't understand it. Like, what's the Infatuation with feces, like literally, it's like a pony, and like it says, like his st- stomach hurts. You got cinnamon, on it, and like, like colorful shit comes out his ass. Like, <laughs> let you hit with your frame, what you hear? That's not the first toy that I seen. That's like on some like, I think they're trying to throw it as like informative. I guess, uh-huh. but I just find it weird. Like, no. Rainbow Churia, yeah, that shit is weird. Like, I don't know. I guess that's probably how they try to. They're trying to. Like a different way of potty training for kids, you but think? like, 
What's it more? It's like marketed towards what? Like ki- like Kenny's age or like younger I, I, or older? I, I don't know. There's a magical unicorn that needs a that needs a poop. He needs to take his shit. He needs a poop. You gotta sit him down. Greta. Yeah. His toys is different nowadays. Nah, his toys is different. <laughs> his toys is different. Especially bro. like um for girls, yeah, I feel bad for girls because it's like I go to Target, I'm like, yes, yeah, come on, Kenny, whatever you want. But it's like what's catered for chicks is not you have a unless it's educational, right? The boys have all type of shit. You got cars, blah blah, blah all, all type of like aisles. A chick got dolls. You mm-hmm. know what I mean? You got dolls, cooking set. Like I mean, like yeah. Damn, we're still on this time. Like, where's yeah, yeah. where's my daughter's racing joint? Yeah, I wanna yeah, get her. Yeah. I wanna get her all pink. Uh, uh, uh race car. Yeah, <laughs> we'll yeah, yeah, all of it. Let's yeah, go. Yeah, yeah. I had it like they should though. I remember they used to have like the Barbie ones. What? But why Barbie though? Why can't she have fucking a fucking Lambo? What, what's what's the what's the little race cars that kids be fucking Hot Wheels? Hot Wheels. Where's the chick yeah. Hot Wheels at? Like. Yeah, yo. You know what I mean? Like all the colors is these gen- these gender norms, man. They gotta break, man. You know what I'm saying, man? No, no, no. no. I'm not <laughs> on that time now. I ain't one of them dudes. Uh, Don't confuse me. I thought I was. But, I don't think I am anymore. <laughs> there's some things that you definitely, I definitely be seeing. Like now that I have a daughter, like, mm, that's not, you know? Uh huh. Uh huh. Yeah. Very weird. Yeah. yeah. Just trying to teach my daughter how to cook. Oh, shopping carts and shit. Teach her how to shop. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know. Not I, I. I don't like it. Kayla wants to start you doing like uh, dress up shit. You know what I mean? Like start getting like so she could play dress up in the crib. Like I don't know. I feel like there's gonna be another one of those toys that I set up and it sits there and collects dust. Uh huh. My daughter's closet got a bunch of it. I got a tent. When uh-huh. she was first, there was like a tent. She's like, "Oh, we, we're gonna go in the tent. And we're gonna read books in the tent." Uh huh. You know what I mean? That's in the closet. Uh-huh. I had another like stupid little toy set that we bought. That's in the closet. I'm like, yo. Yeah, yeah, make yeah. Make me spend this money and throw it in the closet in like six months. Because <laughs> that's what happens with all this shit. Legit, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like the Switch. <laughs> she still gives me shit for that Switch, bro. <laughs> luckily, luckily, we had someone over the crib and I was just like, yo, look. The Switch. Sent it to for, all, for all our loyal listeners out there, I was the one who gave Kayla the idea to buy Michael Switch. Did you know? <laughs> <laughs> and I, I thank you for that one game. Like I got one good you game. Yeah, one out good of, game. Out one of gr- actually well, excellent she, game. She asked me if he. Th- I was like, yeah, he'd like it. Because I was like, why wouldn't he like of it? Of course. And I, I was know. like, worst case scenario, Kenny could play with it. So fuck it. Where I, I don't know about the switch right now. She smashed that thing. Yeah. <laughs> she sm- she, nah, she's not into into games. In right the now. games right now. Mm-mm. She's into. F- and I blame your sister Bonnie if you're listening. Go to hell. Fucking Coco Melon, bro. I want Coco Melon. I want to blow my fucking brain. What's Coco Melon? I'm about, to, I'm about to put a Coco on my melon, dog. I'm trying to tell you, dog. I'm trying to tell you. It is like this little fucking, this little cartoon family with a baby, and all they do is sing. That's what they do. <laughs> Everything is a fucking song. There's uh-huh. not, it's like a TV show, uh-huh. but everything's a song. Yeah, yeah. Every yeah. segment is a song. So now my daughter wants to fucking watch Coco Melon all day, dog. <laughs> and all I hear is these fucking songs. They, they, they don't even like, they're not even like the regular lullabies and shit uh-huh. that we remember. Like, nah, they just made up their own shit. Yeah, uh-huh, It's like, uh-huh. fuck you, I should have thought of that. You know what I mean? You remember the Wiggles? You remember it's the Wiggles? Worse. It's worse. It's way than worse. Fruit salad, yummy, yummy. It's worse than that. I still got that shit stuck in my head. No, it's <laughs> worse. This is Fruit worse. Fruit salad. Bro. This is an hour of torture. It's Chinese torture. It's literally torture. I Chinese torture. <laughs> it's torture, bro. It's torture. I'm telling you, it's torture. Greta. So Bonnie, thank you again. Get a fucking Coco best. Melon. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, what's going on in the news? Shit, more. There was the vice presidential debate. I ain't watched that shit. Nah, not one second of it. Nope. I just I just catch the memes the next day because that's the best Kayla part of this whole thing. And watch the whole thing. I can't believe it. She's a. I, I don't think she wanted to get into politics as much as she's she is now. But nobody has a choice. But because uh, especially because mm-hmm. of her fucking field, bro. It's like mm-hmm. it's, oh yeah, that's yeah. all they want to talk about is just you know what I mean. So yeah. she has to be versed in it now. You know what I mean. Yeah. So it's like. Oh, I don't know how old we're turning real old real fast because 
mm-hmm. we're watching the news mm-hmm. we give a fuck about presidential debates and shit mm-hmm. like what the fuck bro there's a fly I, in Mike Pence's head yeah I guess that's, I guess that's, that's the only thing I know where, about it where and everybody went nuts over it <laughs> it's like oh there's a fly in his head sick yo like what's good with this with this country though <laughs> like, what's good with that I don't, I don't know yeah, what, was that, what was that fucking Netflix? Did you watch that the joint about uh, ag- algorithms and how like uh, social media, or whatever, was how it's affecting the way you view things, how I view things compared to someone else that views something a different way. I haven't seen it, but I that sounds about right. <laughs> you know? <laughs> yeah, yo. Like I got a coworker, right? Her algorithm shows all right wing shit. Only. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. That's only that's only that's the only thing she's gonna see on her feed. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right wing shit. Yep. So she's while we see just left wing shit, yep. super socialism, and it's all bullshit. Yeah. Both sides. Yep. They're feeding you a bunch of hot garbage bullshit. It's just whack, bro. Like they've been they've been selling everybody's Yo, data look, for so long that it's just like, oh my god, you are you are that person now. You is no changing. They they don't want you to change because they're feeding you the same shit, yeah. and you're not learning nothing new. Yeah. You know what I mean? It's fucking sick, yeah, dog. Bro. We're getting the like, even the whole. As humans, like we've got, even though I, maybe we were born to be in small tribes, but that we evolved from that. God, yeah. there's fucking millions of us, dog. I yeah. mean, like, you know what I mean, there's yeah. no more small tribes. Yeah, there's no like we should have like this whole team mentality, dog. Is fucking trash. Yeah, right, left, red, blue, fucking my Giants, your Patriots. Like, yo, don't, at the end of the day, don't fucking matter, dog. Like, we all in this shit. Like, you not see what we all in it together? Like, yeah, as a. That's why I, I really hope that a, like a a <laughs> world like fuck up like pandemic was good kind of we was all in it together. I want aliens to come. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah, I yeah. want it to be real. Like like no, we all gotta get China, Korea, everybody. We gotta all talk about this because we uh, they here. Like I yeah, mean like yeah, now yeah, what? Yeah. Like I mean yeah. Now we really all just fucking humans, right? Because yeah. all motherfuckers came and yeah, right, right? Like yeah, that's what I want. So everybody could wake the fuck up. Yeah, yeah I man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, baby, Sunday, baby. So pumpkin picking is next. Pumpkin, yeah, I mean, picking, pumpkin is picking. Yo, you saw? Yeah, no, but that shit is wild. Like you saw, they try to kidnap the governor of I don't even Michigan. Talk, I don't even want to talk about kidnapping. I didn't hear about yeah. that one though. I, t- my dad said sequestrar, and I didn't know. I was like, "What the fuck is sequestrar?" He's like, "He said it to me in Spanish. Apparently, sequestrar means fucking kidnap." Uh. And I was like, they tried to what now? Uh, to who now? Uh, These what now? Uh, These fucking proud boys, man. They fucking crazy, bro. They fucking wild, bro. I don't know. What's, I've been seeing the dude, the dude that kidnapped that little girl this week, dog. Then I've been, I've been seeing. I don't know. I don't know oh, what the yeah. fuck is up with Instagram's algorithms, but now they're showing me all type of fucking. Yeah, dudes doing wild shit to their daughters and fucking yo, man. I, it's just yo, bro. I can't even look at shit like that. It's fucking. Like, how? How? I can't... Like, when I first had my kid, I'm like, yo, how can motherfuckers leave their kids? Like, look at look at what you created. Like, you gotta leave this little fucking person? Like, are you... Yeah. F- now, you, I'm seeing fucking... Ah, oh, man. Listen. I don't know what the fuck is going on, bro. It's fucking scary, though. Fucking little girl. Duende, can't, duende, duende. Can't even walk home from a school bus. People are like, where's the parents? Motherfucker, when I was when I was growing up, I was walking to school since kindergarten. Yeah. Since kindergarten, bro. I was walking yeah. up the block to school, back to the boys' club. Back, I, you know what I mean? Like, what are we talking about? We, we can't have kids walk the fucking, from their bus stop to their house? What? You just taking a fucking city bus yeah. at fucking 10, 12. That's like, why I get so tight at my school, because they treat it like it's a school in fucking... Central Falls, or and you like gotta lock shit down. Lock shit like the doors are always locked. Like I can't like let the kids go ahead of from recess to like go to their classroom and get rid. Like I have to like there has there has to be there has to be a teacher in the classroom to let them in. And I almost got in trouble for that too. It's just like yo, like it ain't that serious over here, yo. Like I understand like whatever. Like everybody's a parent, so everybody worries for their kids. But let's be real, like these niggas, like it where. <laughs> I'm going to say, <laughs> yo, like, you know what I'm saying? Like, yes, we in fucking Country Day, East East Province. Mm-hmm. What are we talking about? Psst, but, yeah, exactly. Like, but, oh, God. Anyways, you got any happier things to talk about right now instead of fucking all this other bullshit? 
The Yankees lost. Oh, that's a nice day. Hey! That's what I'm the talking Yankees about. Lost. I did see that. And they the lost. Astros won. I talked my shit about the Astros for so long, and they and they they back in the ALCS. Fuck them niggas. <laughs> he said, "Fuck them yeah. niggas, bro." But yeah, the, it's funny because I was talking to my grandfather about. I was like catching up with him, right? And he was like, "Oh yeah, you saw like he, my he loves betting on him. He loves betting on sports, sports right. best and shit like right. that." And I guess my dad told me after I talked to him, I told him I was like, "No, Astros, you're so noodle." I was yeah. like, "The Astros are good." Yeah. He was like, "No, pero ellos están verdad, está una una." Like he's like, "The series is tied one one." I was like, "No, they're up two zero, mm. but they need one more game." I think that they 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 ended it in four, but <laughs> my dad told me like, "Yeah, he bet it on the A's to win, and then the Yankees are his team." So you know that nigga's oh, sick. Like, what the fuck? He's double lost. Damn. <laughs> Damn. But the oh, Yankees yeah. lost. That feels good because the Yankees, they, I mean, like, they got they got a lot of good players. They got players that I like, but, like, they're not a, they just hit home runs. Like, they're not a, te- like, I don't want to say they're not a team, but, like, they're just, they're still, like, still trying to be the fucking Showtime Yankees or whatever, but, like. That's not going to work. That's not going to work. We need, y'all need to learn how to play some small ball. Have you ever got into sports betting before? No, no. I try not. To. I I've been close and like all bro. White boys love that shit. Oh yeah, the white boys love that shit. But I know I should. That would be it's a slippery addictive. slope for me. Yeah, yep. I think so. And I'd rather not. Because yeah, <laughs> I could see, I could see you definitely like parlays all that. I could uh, see you winning a lot, and then you're like, yo, this is easy money. Uh-huh. I'm gonna just sit here, do my research all day, blah yep. blah blah, put some bets in, some locks. Yep. And I'm good. I'm no, I, don't a even do, I don't even do DraftKings, bro. I don't no, do no, none no, of that that's shit. That's bullshit. Yeah. DraftKings is bullshit. Yeah, yeah, I would yeah. never. Yeah. I mean, but some regular bets, like some parlays, some mm-hmm. fucking, some over-unders, some fucking, you know, mm-hmm, mm-hmm, even the mm-hmm. sneaky joints, like, they be having all type of sneaky bets on, yeah. on my boy's app that he just... Mm. They be having I, weird I bets, like, like how, how long do you think a national anthem is going to last? No, that's like, that's <laughs> that's like, like the some other bets. Yeah. Like yeah. like. <laughs> Those are for the, for the niggas, the itchy niggas, bro. No bullshit. Oh, man. For them people, I got a problem. Yeah. Um, damn, I was, I was going to say something about sports. Damn, something happened. It tra- uh, I remember that when you said the Yankees lost. What else happened in sports? What else? What else? The Pats. Let's talk about the Pats. The Pats. The so, Pats. So, yep. so thank God y'all signed Cam Newton on yeah. the minimum, right? Uh-huh, uh-huh. We can all say that now, yep. right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. fucking Stenum and they stank up the place uh-huh. real bad. The the final the final score of that game, though, wasn't that bad, though. But they threw three picks together, didn't they? Brian Hoyer, yeah. Brian, I watched like the first half of the first quarter. And it was like thirteen nothing, and I was like, "Yeah, put on some baseball." <laughs> and, now, and now they got Corona spreading in, in everywhere, and that, and all over the NFL. And Miami's trying to open up full capacity. You saw that? Miami, what the city? The the Dolphins. They're trying to open up their stadium for full capacity. <laughs> Had to 65, be in Florida. Pe- has had to, to be, be in Florida. Florida. It had to be Florida. Fucking Florida, man. Dog. I seen New Zealand. These fucking I seen Gators, New Zealand man. had a had a uh, put their their island that was like way ahead of the curve over there, but they had a full soccer game. I think yesterday. Yeah, but yeah, New Zealand. Everybody else knows it has been de- been had like handled the the Rona. It's us right now. <laughs> like you know what I'm saying? Where. It's just it's funny like and Miami wants to open up the whole stadium. Ah, fuck it, mm-hmm. let them open it. Mm-hmm. I, I know the Pats game just got pushed back to next week, not even Monday. They said not because they. I think there was another player. Yeah, 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 yeah. This morning, Stephen was it Steve, Stephon Gilmore? No, I was last week. They had he, another player. Another one. That's why they pushed it back. They, another they post, post, one. Postponed it to next week. So another how does that one. even work? Like you gonna play two games in a week? How does that work? How do you postpone a football game to next week? Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, the NFL is... It was going to be tough for them. And you hear like all this stuff like headsets going down and quarterbacks calling like... That's how you know. Like Aaron Rodgers, I think he called uh, his, his one, one of his game-winning drives. I, I didn't read too much about it, but they said his, the, the, the comms went down. Yeah. And he called all the plays and they won. Yeah. I feel like I, that's how a lot of these vet quarterbacks feel now. I think... You uh, were Brady. Oh, that's the whole thing with, with Brady. I he didn't. Did, I didn't see the whole. I didn't thing. see it, but apparently the thing was that he missed. Missed. Um, How do you not, the as a downs. quarterback though? Like, 
I could see how the press conference went down. When they, uh, I didn't see it, but like I could see me just like in his head, he's probably like, yeah, I, uh, I'm the quarterback, uh, I'm the head coach, I'm the GM, um, I do everything on this fucking team, and I forgot what down was. I'm sorry, guys, because y'all don't, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like he's like, forgive me. Like I'm human, motherfucker. Like I gotta do everything on I this. I know. Fucking I know. Team. Russell Wilson. The same shit happened to him. His yep. Russell com- Wilson. Yep. Comms went down. He went up for a fucking TD drive. Yep. But uh, besides like highlights, I'm not watching full games. Like, I don't know. I'm not sitting there on Sundays. Like, it's just weird. This shit is weird. Yeah, man. It's not the same. Nothing was the same. Nope. After COVID, <laughs> nothing was the same because. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. You know what I uh, I do? I, I, I do want to set up like a, a night for us to all go out. Especially, like, I want to get Jeff out of that fucking house. Yeah. So, I'm trying to set something up. I don't know if you want to throw out some type of ideas or something, but... I'm down, let's man. All, let's all get up and fucking go I, somewhere. That's what it is. I haven't hit any types of restaurants or bars or anything, and I don't even know how long. Like, because I'm always... I'm just, like, nerd again, this COVID shit, and it's more... more mostly just because... Like, mostly because of my job. Like, they're really right. straight, like... You call for once, and it's just like you gotta hide any symptoms. Like especially now, the season's changing. Like allergies, like you know, it's cold throughout. You gotta call for sneeze. I went out to dinner. Kayla sneezed twice. I'm like, yo, you better watch out. <laughs> yeah, watch right. out. Oh. Let's talk about let's talk about some underlying racism again that we experienced yesterday, right? Because it's like we're in East Greenwich, right? Yeah. So off rip, I already like ain't no one of any type of color out there, right? So then <laughs> we sit down, right? And you you see the manager of the restaurant. This is Cersei, by the way. Uh-huh, I mean, uh-huh. not the one in Prout and the one in East Greenwich, right? Uh-huh. So you see him walking to every table. Is it right? Cersei in East Greenwich? Same same, same owner, joint, same, same joint? I don't know, but it's the same. It's the white Cersei? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> and we go in there. We sit down. And um, you see the manager going from table to table, like, Saying hi to people, how's everything? Blah 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 blah. Mm-hmm. Kayla's, cause Kayla, I got my back to the bar, and like in front of me is just Kayla, but Kayla's seeing everything. Boom, and she's noticing. She's like, I bet you he'll never, he's not gonna come up to us. It's yeah. not gonna happen. And literally saw him go to every fucking chit chat, yeah. everybody. Boom, not a hello, not a thanks for coming, nothing, not a nothing. And she called it since we got there. Yeah. And she's like, fuck these fucking. I'm like, hey, I, I hear you. Yeah. I hear you. I'm like, yo, honestly, he probably looks at us and thinks, damn, my my weight, my weight is not even going to get tipped on this right now. Like, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yep, yep. I know that's how, I, like, like, it, and like, even like, how do you not, like, even like, uh, uh, you know how like uh, Jewish people like to tip a lot just because they want to end that stigma? How yeah. how is it like you do not read that room as the white right. man? Yeah, 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 you know, yeah. The only minority. Like, yep. how do you not read that? Like, Yo, let me especially go over there and you know what I mean. So they, you know what I mean? Yep. Yeah. How do you not I read feel that, that room? I feel that just just off of that that strength alone. Like, uh-huh. Uh-huh. like if, if there was like a lone white boy at a party somewhere that I'm at, and he's the only one. What do we? What do we just not? We're gonna make him feel like the yeah, fucking. Just look, just, Mm-hmm. Like, 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 you know what I mean, like, you think that's yeah. what we're gonna do? Like, again, bro. Like, like, and and we and you see it coming from a mile away. Yeah. Like, you know I mean, that's yeah. be the craziest thing. Yup. Be like when you know someone's a like, I see it coming. Like, here comes the racism. Mm-hmm. Bam, and then yeah. here it is, and it just <laughs> like, goes the race. It is. Bam, yeah, there it is. Cause two, one, boom. I'll never forget, <laughs> dog. And you can ask. I, I got a couple coworkers that was there, right? Fucking this fucking dude at my job and said, um, we'll end on this. I'm trying to get the fuck out of it. What time is it? It's uh, my shit died. That's why I'm over here. Eleven seventeen. <clears throat> he can't. He well, I think we're taking break or something. He's like, this is the kid. The dude's name is Randy Carter. He's a fucking junkie, fucking uh-huh. uh, fucking clown, whatever. Uh-huh. So he's like, Mike, let me ask you something, Mike. <laughs> as soon as he said, "Let me ask you something, Mike," and we're all I'm, we're all together. I'm like, "Here comes the racism. Uh-huh. Here it comes. Uh-huh. Like, it's lined up." Uh-huh. Let me ask you something, Mike. Now or later, is that a black thing or a young thing? <laughs> or like a young black thing? Is that like a is that like a like a drug or like a alcohol? <laughs> I heard Snoop Dogg in one of his songs say, "Now or later." <laughs> so yeah. is that so is that like a I'm like, that's a piece of candy. Yeah, um, yeah. Uh, 
Yeah, it's, that's a candy. That's candy. That's candy. That's, yeah. that's like a candy you could get at any mm-hmm. store. It's called, I choose it's called, now and later. It's called now oh, yeah. and later. Uh-huh. Oh, because I heard him say now later. So I thought uh-huh. it was like Snoop Dogg rap. I thought it was like a, a drink. Or like a drug or something. Yeah. Is that a black thing? At first it was, is that a black thing or a young thing? I like a young black thing. <laughs> like a young black thing. Not only like no, 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 not only no, absolutely right. It is a young black thing. Only is a young it a black, black thing, a young thing, or a young black thing? Oh, man. That's hilarious. You got any shout outs? <laughs> shout out to him, Randy Carter, shout the fucking legend. <laughs> the fucking legend right there. Shout out to Randy. I hope you're, hope you're doing good out there. Oh, Whatever man. Proudly in America. Uh, God damn. God love America though. Holy you shit. Do, right? I be cashing out these checks sometimes doing nothing. I'm like, yeah, I love America. Facts. Gotta love it. Yeah, for the record, I like I like my job. I like those kids. <laughs> All right. Oh, I, I I thought I thought it was you was uh you was definitely about the I mean the chocolate that was still my cup if it needs to. No, I thought you was gonna go on indeed or whatever. You was indeed. It's time, <laughs> time to get about it or something. No, 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 no. I like my job. Where? Job is like it's it's not easy especially because of some of the kids I t- i've talked about that i had to take care of but like it's kind of easy you know it's not hard it's just because i know the school so well so like but yeah now i'm gonna have to like sit down with with three three mothers and and act like i'm the father i pray for you i hope <laughs> i hope it all goes well <laughs> I'll be alright. Bueno, until next week, you dirtbags. Hello.